Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nadia Sdiri Saputri, a public relations student of LSPR Communication and Business Institute under the supervision of Mr. Charles Bonap Sirait as my mentor and my lecturer. I'm here today to talk about breast cancer. First of all, do you know what SDG3 is? SDG3 is one of the 17 Sustainable Development Goals established by the United Nations in 2015 that aims to ensure healthy life and promote well-being for all at all ages. One of the outcome targets that the UN has made is ensure reduction of mortality from non-communicable disease including cancer. The most common cancer case in the world is breast cancer. In Indonesia alone, according to the World Health Organization, the number of new cases in 2020 for both sexes and all ages is 65,858 people were diagnosed with breast cancer and 20,430 people have died. So, what is breast cancer? Breast cancer is a type of cancer that starts in the breast. It forms in the cells of the breast. It happens when the cells in the breast grow and divide out of control and create a mass of tissue that is called tumor. There are so many types of breast cancer like ductal carcinoma in situ, invasive ductal carcinoma, globular carcinoma in situ, invasive lobular carcinoma, triple negative breast cancer, inflammatory breast cancer, and metastatic breast cancer, and so many more. Breast cancer itself is divided into stages based on the size of the tumors and how much it has spread. There are stage 0, stage 1, stage 2, stage 3, and stage 4 of breast cancers. The causes of breast cancer are not fully understood. No one knows the exact causes of it. One person may develop breast cancer and another one may not. But there are risk factors that are associated with developing breast cancer such as being female. Women are most likely to develop breast cancer and a family history of breast cancer. Like if your sister, your daughter, your mother were diagnosed with breast cancer, then the potential of your developing of breast cancer is there. To detect breast cancer is to do a breast self-examination before by using the other hand to feel and check the breast if there is any fluid coming out from the nipple. Some signs of breast cancer may include a lump in the breast or underarm, swelling or thickening of all parts of the breast, and persistent breast pain. Despite the causes of breast cancer that we still do not know exactly how, we still can reduce the risk factor of developing breast cancer by living a healthy lifestyle like exercising regularly or being physically active, maintaining a healthy weight, and avoiding or limiting your alcohol intakes. We also can breastfeed for several months to reduce the risk of developing breast cancer. Awareness towards breast cancer is very, very important. We collectively should learn more about what breast cancer is, how to reduce the risk factor of developing breast cancer, what symptoms people should look for, and what people can do if they are diagnosed with breast cancer. In so many platforms, including Instagram, there are so many organizations that provide such information and one of them is Love Pink Indonesia. Love Pink Indonesia is one of the non-profit organizations that focus on socializing activities for early detection and also mentoring for fellow women and breast cancer survivors by 
creating a private campaigns and also supporting each other to the content they post on Instagram. Love Pink Indonesia also has a big role to spread awareness about breast cancer and to encourage women also breast cancer survivors with their contents. So, breast cancer is the most common cancer experienced by women and rarely with men. It happens when the cells in the breast are growing out of control. Breast cancer is the most common cancer cases worldwide and surpassed lung cancer in 2020. Awareness about breast cancer can help so many people, so it is very important for us to contribute to spread awareness. That's all I can say about breast cancer for today. I really hope it can help you all to be more aware and more understand about what breast cancer is. Thank you so much for your attention, stay safe and stay healthy.